Wait, you want to do what? You want to add fun money into your budget? Have you lost your mind? Hey guys, it's Wendy Valencia. Welcome back. And if you are new to my channel on this channel, we talk about all this tough stuff that nobody wants to talk about. Money, weight loss, getting organized, all that. Nobody ever wants to do it, but it's stuff we have to do. So if that interests you, go ahead and click that big red subscribe button down below and then go click that bell notification icon so you will be alerted every time I upload because it gets uncomfortable on this channel and you need to deal with some of those issues. So today we are tackling a topic that the Dave purists are not going to like at all. Not even a little bit. So what's a Dave purist? Um, it's kind of a term that I made up myself. It is someone who follows Dave Ramsey so hardcore that they cannot possibly imagine deviating from beans and rice or any other phase in the process. We are not that family. We are about cutting back as much as we can but not completely getting rid of everything. And that is what we're specifically focusing on today. If you saw my October budget plan video, you will have seen we are adding $100 to our monthly budget for family fun. And here is why. Recently, Mauricio, Melina, and I went out to a place called Cox Farm. It's Cox Farms Day. What is the record of the... For the... For the world's largest company. Whoa! Let's get some yes, let's get some pictures. Farms is a place that comes out every fall. The end of September, early October, they open up and they are open through, I believe, the last week in November. And basically, they are a place you can go and buy pumpkins. You can go and enjoy the fall. They have a corn maze, which was so much fun. This is so cool. <laughs> Oh, no, nothing is long and tickly. Hey, pirate treasure earth! Treasure! Pirate! Help, I'm lost in a corn maze! At night, apparently, they turn it into a haunted corn maze, which I would love to do, but it's a little expensive to do, so I'm not, we're not doing that. We're going on a hayride! They had hay rides, which were so cute. Melina had such a blast on the hay ride. Oh, 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 oh. No easy way. Oh, oh, hey. Hey. Is it gonna be bumpy? Oh. Do you see what's up here? We're gonna have to go oh. through the water. No. Shrek! Door hat! One thing! That's me with the rainbow! Looks like we're approaching a railroad crossing. I sure yeah. hope the train isn't coming. Look at you! That scared the crap out of me. Up on your right, you'll see the invisible man and his son. But I'm not quite sure if they're there. Oh, you are so clean and pretty. Thanks for coming to Cox Farm. Thank you, thank you. Bye, Spiky. <laughs> uh, oh, that popcorn smells amazing. I know. I am so hungry. Yeah. It was totally cheesy, but you know, for a five-year-old, it was so much fun. And then the best part, besides the food, they had, by the way, the best kettle corn I have ever had in my life. I ate a lot. It is a miracle I won diet bet because I seriously, when I finished, I counted up the points. It was 22 points for the popcorn I ate. Francie is here just for the popcorn. Good popcorn. Best popcorn ever. Get out of my popcorn. 
the the very best part was the slides. They had these slides all over the place where you could climb up and slide down. And Melina is a little daredevil and she would go down all of them by herself. She did not Again. want her parents to go down. <laughs> I did go down the biggest slide with her and it was so much fun. Ready? On your mark! Get set! Go! <laughs> and they also had this place called Foamhenge. It was a life-size replica of Stonehenge made out of these big foam pillars. I know it looks like I'm at Stonehenge but I'm at Foamhenge. It was super cool and Mauricio actually posted it and several of his friends thought we had gone to England. We didn't. It was a blast. And so after that, Mauricio and I were talking and we had such a great time as a family that we felt like it was almost a necessity for us to go ahead and continue on doing family bonding stuff. The majority of the time we will do things that are free or almost free because here in DC there is a ton of free stuff to do. We can go to museums, we can go to parks, and in fact the other day we even went out to the end of the runway at the airport and watched the planes land and that was so much fun. And that was free. But it's the fall and all of the fall stuff is coming out and it costs money. And Melina is only going to be five years old once in her life. And I don't want her to miss out on these memories and these opportunities of fun stuff. And sure, in two years or three years or five years at the rate we're going, however long it takes us to get out of debt, she'll still be able to do these things. But it's different when you're five and when you're six. And so we are just going to do this. $100 is minimal in our budget. So for now, this is what we're going to do. Like it, don't like it. I, I totally get it. I totally get it if you are a Dave purist and you don't like us doing this. But this is what we need to do for our family. We are living with my parents right now. We don't do anything with just the three of us. And so we're going to start. We are sacrificing a lot to get out of debt and this little piece will help it, us make it through the process and we will make it. And it's gonna take a long time, but we are going to be debt free eventually. And we will take you guys on the process every single step of the way. You can see our goods, our bads. We have some major bads, <laughs> a lot recently. But we are back on track and it is October and we are doing fantastically with the cash envelope. You having fun? What's been your favorite thing so far? The hot dog? The big slide? It was the blue slide, wasn't it? What's been your favorite thing? When I was at home this morning, laying in bed, playing with my phone. Of course it was, not. He, it was the popcorn. Best popcorn ever. You might want to take your sunglasses off. Whoa. It's crooked in here. If 
you are new to my channel, make sure you click on my big laughing face to subscribe and I will put up two videos for you to keep on watching. This video up here is my latest one and this one right here is one YouTube picked out just for you. So I'll see you in the next one. See ya!